in YouTube. Hey y'all, welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you're new, please subscribe, give this video a thumbs up and comment down below what you guys wanna see next. If you're not new and you've been subscribed, hey girl, how you doing? Or hey boy, how you doing? Like, okay, <laughs> thank you guys so much for tuning back in. I thought this video would be super exciting to do because it's just, you know, my opinion about Christmas and feel free to agree. Feel free to disagree. It's all fun here, okay? Um, but yeah, follow me on social media and let's get into the video. Okay, this is the first one on my list. And I just gotta say it. Somebody gotta say it. Somebody gotta discontinue it at this point. Like, eggnog is disgusting, <laughs> okay? And if y'all don't know what eggnog is, it's this, like, holiday drink. I don't know who be drinking it because it's not good. But <laughs> it's this holiday drink and it's super, like, Thick. I just don't like the texture. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Had to hit him with the. Mm -mm. Like the consistency is really thick, and I just don't. Oh, y'all, it stresses me out. I do not like it. Like, mm -mm. so if you ever try to offer me eggnog, I'm just gonna take it as you're trying to kill me. And why would you want to do that? Like, <laughs> like why? I I don't understand eggnog. It should be discontinued. Don't give nobody that. Okay. <laughs> All right okay another one oh man this is big one i really feel like this is creepy honestly elf on a shelf is creepy so if you don't know what elf on a shelf is basically your parent puts up a elf on a shelf and it's supposed to watch you i guess um and it tells whether you're good or bad i don't know it's like some stuff for kids you know but i just feel like it's not needed i feel like it's creepy it's probably gonna scare your kids and why why the elf gotta watch them like why can't you watch them like the <laughs> like i feel like it's for fun purposes of course but i just think it's creepy like i really do oh this is a big one so i really want to experience a white christmas and if you don't know what that is it's just like experiencing snow on christmas i really want to experience that i've been in snow before but not on christmas like i feel like that would make a christmas so beautiful to get that snow experience like i'm from california it does not snow out here okay like it don't it it probably gonna rain on christmas or something that's gonna be crazy if i jinxed it but it never snows on christmas like i I, I would love to experience that i truly would and imagine how bomb my pictures will come out like it, it will give it really would so yeah i really want to experience that mm. most christmas songs and don't at me you could at me if you want to but you don't you don't want to do that most christmas songs i feel like should just be played in elevators like i feel like it's elevator music like it's so like repetitive and you always hear it you know and it's just like Oh no, it's just there. Like, but don't get me wrong, I do mess with some Christmas albums, so y'all know, like, okay, of course, Mariah Carey. All I want for Christmas is you. Yeah, y'all know it. Y'all know it. Don't act like you don't know it. And first of all, that Boys to Men Christmas album, okay, like, it's fire. If y'all don't know, let me put you on Boys to Men Christmas album. That. That's where it's at. And Whitney Houston's um, soundtrack from Preacher's Wife, definitely. Like, oh, those Christmas songs take me in. Like, so yeah, if we're playing any Christmas music, those are the three, you know, I would love to hear. But anything past, I'm just, you know, it's just playing. Oh, this is honestly like, I feel like a lot of people would agree with this one. I feel like the older you get, the less exciting Christmas is. And I'm sorry to the kids that are watching. I don't want to ruin your Christmas. Have fun, baby. But y'all know, like, if you're older, it, it's not the same. Like, I remember literally counting down the days until Christmas. And now I'm just like, oh, it's next week? Like, oh, okay. Cool. Nice. Like, <laughs> like I, I don't know. The excitement just left. Like, and we really don't get as much like presents anymore so it's just like mm, you know but 
it, it, it's still cool. It's Christmas. Y'all know how it is. But yeah. Oh. Stop. And I'm going to say it again. Stop. I probably scared y'all. Sorry. <laughs> but stop. The Polar Express slander. Please. Like, please. Like, I seen unpopular opinion videos and people have been like oh i don't like public express public express stupid public express. how you don't like it like that was our childhood like what do you mean like christmas break you knew you were finna sit in front of the tv and watch that movie like i don't understand why people don't like it like i feel like it's a lit christmas movie honestly and it, like i said that was part of our childhood like how don't you like it like if you tell me that you went on christmas break and you didn't watch that movie you're crazy <laughs> like you're crazy i don't i don't know how people don't like it but just stop it just stop like don't don't ever come around me and say i don't like polar express because i'm just look at you like this and you ain't gonna want to be looked at like that i bet you so yeah just don't don't say polar express ain't it it's it okay okay now in my opinion christmas movies are top tier I love Christmas movies, so I love, you know, the classics. I love Home Alone. Elf is hilarious. Um, Will Ferrell, that's like, he's so funny. And then um, Polar Express, like I said. But my top favorite Christmas movie is This Christmas. Like, that's one of the movies I'll just never get tired of watching. Like, <laughs> like BET, that's all they play around this time. That's what you're going to see. And like I said, it's one of those movies I'm just never get tired of watching. I'm going to always be into it. Like, I love, love, love that movie. Mm -hmm. Y'all about to... <laughs> somebody going to come for me probably. And I don't know how. I really don't know how I haven't. But I haven't seen The Grinch. I don't have nothing against it. I just never watched it. I don't know why. <laughs> Like I said, I don't know if I want to, like, and I'm not bashing the Grinch at all. I just never watched it, like, I don't know how. I just never have. <laughs> okay, so, to each his own, but in my opinion, you don't need a real Christmas tree to celebrate Christmas, like, a fake one is cool. Christmas trees, the real ones, make me itch. Like, they make me itch. Like, it's just, I don't know... I don't know it just makes me itch I don't mm -mm. so if you know if that's your thing and you want a real Christmas tree cool but I just can't be around if it's there because I start itching really bad like it's awful and I feel like white Christmas trees over green ones I feel like the green ones are too common and the lights around the Christmas trees when they're white look bomb like I feel like they look better I feel like presentation is there I feel like it's there like but when you get the green one it's more basic everybody has a green Christmas tree like that's not fun no more like you don't want to be like everybody else <laughs> like I don't know um but in my opinion we just gonna stick with the white ones and keep it pushing okay <laughs> okay this is another one this is something I've never even experienced I have never experienced opening gifts early defeats the purpose of Christmas like what did you have to wait for you how are you excited like you get to do it early how are you excited like i'm not understanding that <laughs> like i feel like opening gifts at 12 a.m should not be a thing like it really shouldn't like in my family first of all okay family showed up right all right you gotta wait till you know everybody's all together you go eat your food and then you open presents around like five six you know that's how we did it like we never got to open them early but I feel like the anticipation of that is everything like I remember just like okay I remember what I told him I wanted all right is my name like and I remember just like seeing my name written on certain gifts and I'm like okay it's probably that like this probably that I feel like that's more exciting when you have to wait for it like I don't know I don't know it's more exciting if you have to wait for it in my opinion like yeah, be patient, okay? Be patient. <laughs> oh, this is another one. Take your Christmas tree down after two to three days. <laughs> like, we don't want to see it in January, sis. <laughs> like, I feel like it's just taking up unnecessary space, honestly. Like, like, 
I don't know why people be leaving it up so long. I don't know if it's just a lazy thing. That's probably what it is, huh? But I just feel like you should want space in your house. So you should <laughs> take the tree down. Like, we do not want to see it in January. I promise you we don't. Like, we don't. Um, it's a new year. Like, new year, new things. Maybe clean your house. Like, okay. But if that's you, you know, you keep it up a little longer. God bless you. But it's not recommended. <laughs> It's really not peppermint bark is gross I don't like it it's not a friend to my taste buds like I just don't be sitting right with me I don't know like I just it's not something that I'd like to engage in on holidays like I just don't like Christmas like not Christmas I just don't like peppermint bark I don't know why <laughs> I just don't like it <laughs> All right, a lot of people gonna feel some type of way about this one. Um, say what you want, but I'm gonna say it. I'm gonna just say it. Turkey is not a part of Christmas food. Like, that was for Thanksgiving. We had that already, love. Like, I feel like, mm, I feel like turkey and Thanksgiving go hand in hand. You know, that's what you're supposed to have. But I feel like on Christmas, you're supposed to have ham. Like, Christmas and ham, everything. Like, that just makes you feel warm inside. Like, it's a warm feeling. You know what I mean? Like, you ever had some bomb ham on Christmas, y'all? Like, you can't go wrong. But what I don't want to do is put turkey and ham on my plate. I don't want to do that. Like, I, <laughs> I, we don't want to do that. We're going to leave Thanksgiving where Thanksgiving was. We're going to leave Christmas to where Christmas is. You feel me? And we just going to have ham. Period. Blank. Blank. What? Period. Point. Blank. That's what we're doing. Don't care. <laughs> this is something that um i've never seen in real life <laughs> i don't know if people do it i don't think they do honestly but christmas caroling in the movies is completely different than real life i've never seen anyone like just start singing and coming up to houses i've never seen that like if i did i'd probably get excited like uh oh but i've never seen that like is that a thing y'all comment that down below like do people do that where you live at where they do that at because i they don't do that over here like nobody nobody wants to sing nobody wants to bring me into the spirit of christmas like just gotta send yourself there i guess <laughs> like i don't know but yeah i've never seen that in real life if you, they do that in your town you let me know i'm gonna come visit because i would love to see it for real oh now to the people that do say this you know God bless you, but it's not recommended. I don't like when people say, <laughs> I don't like when people say Merry Xmas. I don't know why it stresses me out. Like, I don't know what that is. What does Merry Xmas mean? What is that? Merry Christmas? Okay, Merry Christmas. Yeah, happy holiday. Yeah. Merry Xmas? No, no. Don't say that to me. <laughs> like, I don't know. Like, no. When did that happen? Like, when did they start saying that? Like, I don't, I don't even know when it started, but I just wish it didn't. I don't know. I just don't. I don't like it. I can't tell you why. I just don't. Like, I don't I don't like it. Now, y'all know that Christmas popcorn be bussin'. So, in my opinion, Christmas is not Christmas without the bucket of popcorn. Like, it... <laughs> Let me tell y'all. Let me tell y'all the flavors, okay? Because it comes with the cheddar, okay? Then it comes with the caramel, okay? And then it comes with the butter. Like, that is the best Oh, that's the best container of anything like I when Christmas came around you knew where I was at I was in that bucket of popcorn like I'd have to get it taken away from me sometimes because I would eat that and then not really be hungry for my food but in my opinion that popcorn is like the best popcorn I've ever tasted so if you don't have that on Christmas I just feel like you're not really experiencing what Christmas is <laughs> like you're not ugly sweaters a no-go it's a no for me they look like they make you itch like i've never been a part of anything like that i don't think i would i don't know but <laughs> i just feel like chris like the ugly christmas sweaters they just as well they're ugly like they're called okay and then why can't they be cute ugly like why can't it be cute sweaters like i don't know why is that not a thing like why don't they want you to be great why do you have to wear an ugly sweater like and like i said it just looks like It'll make you itch, like, the material that they're made out of. I don't know. I got sensitive skin, so I feel like it'll make me itch. But, you know, if you ever participated, I hope you have fun, love, okay? I really do. Now, look. Okay, um, 
if you haven't seen my last video you definitely need to go tune in because that's related to this so homemade cookies are better than store-bought cookies in my opinion i like it when it's hot and fresh out the oven okay like nothing can beat that nothing like <laughs> you like the store-bought cookies yeah they're cool but that's not homemade okay that's not homemade like you got to stick where it's homemade at i feel like homemade food just is different but homemade cookies oh <laughs> like it just hits different oh this is one of my favorite things about christmas because i love 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 gingerbread okay gingerbread is fire you will catch me eating that like i i love it and then i'm all here for it so if you have if even ginger snaps have y'all ever had ginger snaps like i love that as well like fire okay being surprised for christmas is unmatched like i know you know you probably want to be nosy and know what you're getting for christmas but just let it be a surprise please like just let somebody you know bless you with something and it actually be a surprise i feel like the gift is more appreciated that way um you know because if you know what you're gonna get you know you acting like you don't know but you knew and then you're like huh thanks i already knew i was getting that like you know it's not fun like <laughs> i feel like it's not fun after that point oh christmas pajamas are everything don't care like it feels like it's made out of softer material than regular pajamas like and they're super cute they're super super comfortable like i don't know what i was gonna say but <laughs> they're super cute and they're super comfortable this is a must i feel like hot chocolate needs the marshmallows like i feel like it's not hot chocolate without them like i don't i'm just looking at chocolate milk like no marshmallows inside no no okay i didn't deserve that like i just feel like hot chocolate needs the marshmallows okay that's just a must mm -hmm. Oh, this is a big one, and I know a lot of people can agree, but holiday candles are the best. Like, the pumpkin spice, like, the cookie ones, that I love all of those. Like, I just, they need to keep them in season longer, in my opinion. And this is my last one. I did 25, if you didn't notice. <laughs> but, in my opinion, it just feels like, more like Christmas if there's a fireplace involved. Like, it's warm, it's cozy like you can drink hot chocolate on the couch fireplace lit like listen to christmas music and really be chilling and having a vibe so yeah i feel like you know fireplaces just should definitely be involved for christmas okay it feels more like christmas that way so that was my last one like i said i hope you guys enjoyed this video i hope that um Maybe some of you agreed somewhere, but if you didn't, that's okay. I still love you. Like, it's completely fine. Um, yeah, so be back for my next YouTube video. Turn my bell notifications on if you haven't already to be notified when I post next time. Uh, give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already. And, uh, yeah, I think that's it. Merry Christmas, y'all. Love you. Bye.